California is just one of several states now suing the Trump administration over its decision to add a question on U.S. citizenship to the 2020 census. Critics say the question will intimidate immigrants and discourage them from participating. Cronkite News reporter Ariana Bustos talked with one Valley leader in the ongoing census debate in Washington. Mesa Vice Mayor David Luna, who spoke at a conference on the census, worries the addition of the citizenship question will hinder the one job the census is supposed to do. The Constitution calls for persons. Uh, persons are individuals that live in your community. What we're afraid of is that if a person is required to put whether he or she is a citizen, that may hamper the process and the collection of the data necessary. This matters because the number of congressional districts in a state and distribution of federal funds relies on an accurate count of population by the census. Luna is part of the National Association of Latino Elected Officials, an organization that says it will fight back against the question. Executive Director of Naleo, Arturo Vargas, released a statement saying, adding a question on citizenship at this time would only seek to fan the flames of fear and distrust in the census, further risking depressed response rates. But Hans von Spakovsky, a senior legal fellow at the Heritage Foundation, said the census will be inaccurate without the question. Look, all the claims that this is somehow um, going to make the census I inaccurate, uh, you should think about the fact that if you're not asking the question at all, then the data you're collecting isn't going to be accurate either. Von Spakovsky said the question provides necessary data for voting rights. David Olson, Associate Director of Field Operations at the Census Bureau, said recently the Bureau will work the same despite the addition of the question. We are going to work with all of our partners to get the message out that it's important, it's safe, and uh, it's really critical uh, for the future of our nation. He said not to worry. Whether the census is 10 questions or 11 questions, uh, our commitment is the same. We're going to count everybody. Reporting from Washington, Adiana Bustos, Cronkite News. The citizenship question has not been on the full census since 1950. But backers of the move note that the question does appear on the yearly American Community Survey. That survey is sent to about 2 to 3 percent of the population each year.